gobs here. There's a gob right there. Bum, 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 bum. Also, where's my soul niger? Soul nigers are usually at the end of the dungeons. And now I'm here. Oh, it wants me to climb this. And then go up here. There's the soul niger speaking to existence. They're like majority of the time at the end of the dungeon. Let me teach you a thing or two. Yo, this happened on Greg looks really cool. Right over there. Hey it's really awesome. Quick to water absorbs everything else. We're gonna want water then. We're gonna wanna do a lay change. Is basically what I'm hearing. How much are you gonna give me? Only 2,000 lucky card, not really worth. Change. Don't you dare put the water. I hate you. Watch this. Of course it did that. Why wouldn't it do that? Oh no. It's gonna hurt Dean. Ba -bum. I'm gonna send you packing. Do this again. <laughs> Luck into water? Okay, good, I'll take it. Volcanic trap. I'm still standing. He is still standing? What a guy. Hi, I'm Dean. Mm, probably should heal. Would be the smart thing to do. Try this, you'll get better. Although I just realized Greg is low on HP. Although it's getting Dean and Carol, doesn't matter. You widespread high heal? You go to the water one and start spamming high blast. Let's take them all out at once. You also want to get you two off the earth one, one because everything. if it goes to the wind one, then it's going to do some devastating damage. Maybe I can even fit like a combination move or something. Actually, switch you out for Avril. You keep going with the high blast. Might as well. Here's a taste of pure ice. Begin. I'll move right away. Ah, no Sonic Vision. It's fine. Don't really need any of this. Just like, <laughs> just make it a shutout, just to do something. You can reach Lightning Fang from all the way over here? That's wild. I didn't think it had that good range. have heavy crush anymore because you have the other medium that's fine just normal attack it and then dean can finish it oh you know what 
I didn't realize. Okay, it's fine. I'm still gonna die. Goodbye. This is the end. Oh, it didn't make a sound. Don't soul nagers normally make a sound? Now we can do anything we want. Ba -ba 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 Oh, save point. Hello. I didn't even see you here. So we got another dragon fossil, so I can do another upgrade. Drag more magic. Rebecca, more attack. Dean, more attack. Carol, I'll probably do the FP bonus. And then Avril, I'll do more attack as well. Look, Dean, it's the stolen food. Yeah, now if we can just get it back to Honey's Day, I'll be in fried noodle heaven. But it looks like we got some company to deal with first. Is that who I think it is? It's Olivier. The boss you fight in Loka's prologue in Wild Arms 2. He's also in Wild Arms 3. He had a... He used a status ailment in that game. He was in Wild Arms 2 and 3. I know that ugly face anywhere. That must be the boss the gobs were talking about. Ugh. Looks like he's not gonna just hand over the food. It's like the beast of gluttony, right? I think this thing has like a glutton property. But the people back at Honey's Day are starving and so am I. And he won't give it to us. We'll just have to take it for ourselves. Is this thing still called Olivier? Yeah, Boss Olivier. It is the same name as Wild Arms 2 and 3. Weak. Ooh, absorbs every element. 8,500 experience. Oh, I only have one lucky card, though. I have two. Never mind. I'm going to use a lucky card. All right, enough said. I am going to use a lucky card. <laughs> hmm. Trying to think of how I want to do this. It's got the Muse Amulet. Nothing really worth stealing. It absorbs every element. So we're going to want Avril or Carol. That should be the best position. Try to slow down this hex. Yeah, because he has nowhere else to go. Forbidden games. I don't know. Oh, it did poison. Although Rebecca should have the Moonstone. Lay change isn't really going to help because, again, it's like... It absorbs every element. This, I'll show you. High Blast and Heavy Crush have to be, like, non-elemental. Try this. See how this does for speed. Still nothing. Lucky card here. Alright, he's on the water hex now. Alright, still fine. I don't feel like losing today. You should probably. Go here. Capture the high ground and win. And then get rid of whatever this yeah, poison. It's really only affecting Dean though, because Rebecca has the moonstone. Oh, okay, that reset my quicken. Do it again. It's a lot of turns. You can Mystic Ocean Berry. I mean, like, having Mystic is honestly enough for a heal. We probably don't even need Carol. It's like we never even touched it. 
Looks like it heals its HP back to full when it enters one of the lay points. So we just need to split up and make sure we get to those first. Right, that's the plan. Or I can just corner it. Wouldn't that work too? <sighs> that would really hit home. Cornering it should also work, shouldn't it? Although we can't really corner it because it's got one behind it, so we would have to like wait till it goes behind the thing to corner it. You're more vulnerable now. Although it wouldn't move back theoretically because then it wouldn't be able to hit Greg or anyone rather. I only have one of these. It's really not what I want to do. Spread a little pain around. Strip up there! Yeah, it's gonna stay here. What is this? Disease? There's the disease. Oh, no effect though? Oh, right, because disease makes it where you can't heal or something. Twelve hundred. I don't feel like losing today. I'm gonna have to switch you out. I think. Put in Avril. I'll let you take this for me. Anything worthy? Just a muse amulet. I might as well steal it and see what it gives me. I'll take that. Just because I can. Thought I could catch you off guard. Never mind. It's gonna kick Avril. Oh, easy. Nice blocker. Shoot it. Well, don't do that. Bad idea. This is refreshing. I'm too good at critting this thing. Now you should shut out so it can't move. It's mad. No big deal, just adds disease to that. I swear by my arm. Strip up bear. You do not want to strip this thing bare. Like you just don't. Like look at this freak. Look at this monstrosity. Trust me, you don't want to do that. Protect really isn't gonna come in handy. I'll move. Hmm, overhead sorcery or trigger rondo? Probably overhead sorcery. Patient. This this thing is gonna take a minute. Hmm. Let's switch you out. Well, eventually we'll switch you out. I might kill Rebecca, this but I can just get her up. We're gonna have to switch in Carol anyway. Don't know oh no, she this. lived because she blocked. Nice. Getting Carol here. You're up. 
Adds invincible stats to the hex until the next ally's turn. Not really what I'm looking for now. At this point, we're gonna win. It's just a matter of time. Like that? Here goes. That was excessive. Yeah, you're done now. I don't remember if Olivier was in Wild Arms Four. I don't think he was. I think it was just Wild Arms 2 and 3. 2, 3, and 5. I love it when the Wild Arms games not just reuse oh, enemies, but it's bring back tonight. bosses as callbacks. It's really nice. Hey, level 34. Yes, fried noodles. Finally, we'll have something to eat. I'm starved too. What about that machine? Should we not investigate it as well? Yeah, let's see what it had. Let's see what it is. Words. Yeah, who knows? Maybe it'll have something about Johnny Appleseed in there. Let's take a look. Looks like the thing that was in the Baskar Shrine, doesn't it? But it's a little different. Look, there's a place on top of that ball where you can put something. Are those letters? It looks like something's written there, but I can't tell what. Mediums. Those which connect all? Whoa, you could read that? Yeah, I don't know why, but I have no trouble reading these letters. It seems that this device allows memories to be shared by using mediums. Yeah, so what do I do? Just put my medium here? Whoa, it's that golem. Yeah, the golem arm that carried Avril. So that story you told me about the golem arm falling down from the sky, that was actually true? That's what it looks like. So you thought it was a lie all this time. Man, I mean Greg did. Okay, I'll go next. Oh, you're acrobatic shooting. Wow, this looks neat. Really? I guess it was something of a turning point for me after all. I doubt I'll ever forget that day. Okay, my turn. Oh, that's the professor. Figures, that's exactly who we were thinking of. He sure was interesting, wasn't he? Interesting? Well, I suppose you could see him that way. Okay, Greg, you try it. I'll pass, thanks. Nothing I'd want to see anyway. Yeah, you have like some kind of big trauma in your past or something. Well, if you say so. Avril, how about you? Who knows, maybe it'll show some of your missing memories. Yeah, I hope so. Why is Chuck here? What the heck? It's like the future? Or something? That, that's Dean, isn't it? Yeah, that was everyone. It looks like it. You both look like you're desperate about something. Did something happen? I don't know. And besides, where is this? I don't know. I'm pretty sure I'd never seen any place like that before. Greg, have you ever seen it? Nope. I've been around the world many times, but I've never seen any place like that. Avril, what is this? I don't know. Not where it is, nor what's happening. But there's something about it. it feels like a very important place to me. Important, but also very lonely. I was hoping your memory would come back, but instead things have just gotten more confusing. Sorry, Rebecca. No, you don't need to apologize. If anything, it's our fault for not being able to help you more. Not at all. I deeply appreciate all the help you've given me. I can only hope I'll be able to learn who Johnny Appleseed is. Speaking of Johnny Appleseed, the people in Honey's Day said he was seen around here, right? 
Yeah, but I haven't seen anything like that that would give us hints about him. I guess we'll just have to... Look, there's a medium there among the stuff the gobs collected. Whoa, so there is. You think it might have belonged to Johnny Appleseed? You can't be serious. They probably stole it from Honey's Day along with everything else. Hey, you never know. Let's put it in that machine and see what's in it. You don't even know whose it is. I wouldn't really feel right peeking into someone else's life. I feel like there's important information contained within this medium. Important information? Have you seen this medium before, Avril? No, I don't think so. Well, there's only one way to find out. Here goes. I guess. What about your fried noodles? Who's that? He looks sort of like a Varuni, but maybe it's just my imagination, but his features seem somewhat human as well. So could that child that was born to the Varuni and human couple you were talking about? Or so could he be, I think that said. I don't know. Never actually met him, only heard about him, so... Hey, isn't that this room? Looks like it. So do you think he's Johnny Appleseed after all? If only we could hear what he's saying. Is he crying? Yeah, it looks like it. Look, there's a black shadow. Huh? Look, the medium. It stopped responding. Seems to have broken. Oh, and just when it was getting good. Wait a minute. Who was just saying we shouldn't be peeking into other people's lives? You got a problem, mister? No, not at all. In any case, it looks like we weren't able to learn anything at all. That can't be helped. We'll just have to go somewhere else and keep looking. Yeah, it's the spirit, Avril. I'll go with you, at least until I find the professor. Oh. Haha, <laughs> looks like the first thing we need to do is get ourselves a meal. Yeah, let's get ourselves some fried noodles. With the boss of the gobs taken care of, I doubt they'll be bothering the village for a while. Let's just take what we can carry, along with that spark plug for the mono wheel, and have the villagers come and get the rest. Spark plug. Sounds like a plan. Let's hurry back to Honey's Day and tell everyone the news. Two blank mediums. if I go up here. This is way too much to take back by ourselves. We'll have to ask the people in Honey's Day to come get it. Hey, I hope you fast traveled me out of here. Oh no, there, there's a really easy way to leave. You just fall off the uh, elevated area. Because that's the beginning of the area, so it should be really easy to leave. All we gotta do is go down here. Yo. Let's look at the map. I think this way is how we leave? Now it's east. We want to go south. 